You gotta open it up for the man. Never been opened. Yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> it still looks good, man. Can I see it though? Can we see it? We get to have this back on the dyno too. M8 Screaming Eagle heads. Oh God, what am I doing? It's like you bought these knowing we were coming in tonight. Guess what? With this, you have to put a bigger camera. The motor's open. I got about <laughs> five seconds of saying, no, I'm not gonna do it before I said yes. Champion cycle to get another update on the lowrider ST. Let's go. Dan's nice enough to let us come back and film on the busiest night so far. For sure. So far. This year. There's people loading bikes off U Hauls, there's customers everywhere, and it's what time is it? Like 8 o'clock at night? I don't know. It's, yeah, yeah, it is quarter after 8. And uh, I was going to go over a quick update on the, on the build here. Let's figure out where we're going to mount this. So we made the bracket, as you can see. It's all yep. done and made. Yep. We'll powder coat it after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's for your mirror, mm -hmm. right? Mirror will hang down or up, just like this side wheel, right? Mm -hmm. So, good. Now we can either mount this, see this stud? Mm -hmm. We can either mount a little bracket and bring it nicely right here, or down, we can put a rubber yeah, on the floor. Yeah, I, I, I'd probably area. sit it somewhere here, so it's kind of... It looks pretty cool though. Yeah, but your, yours will be black, right? It won't be the gold. Yeah. So it'll be right there, and then it'll have the nice clear Brembo holes that'll run up the bar nice and go into there, okay? Look, I'll turn this down. Okay. So that's option one. Option two is we use the back half of this thread and mount the bracket somehow like right here. Mm -hmm. Right? Which is more common with what you'll see. Most people put them like from factory, they sit like higher because yeah, yeah, technically yeah, yeah. you're supposed to have it elevated, but I mean, we'll bleed it up here and then we'll just mount it down there and get all the air bubbles out just like a stunt bike would. Yeah. So it can be, it can be lower. It can be kind of wherever we want. Really? Yeah. yeah. So as long as we get all the air out, right, accordingly. So, yeah, uh, yeah that's basically it. It's either we mount this sucker, because I think you want your mirrors up. Up, up, yeah. So if the mirror is going to go up, then I'm going to be, I can't put it over here or over here, right? Because the bracket. Because yeah, the mirror is going to be in the way. So, yeah. and I don't want to put it back here because it'll look terrible. Well, we could always mount it so it sits here. We'll, I'll make a nice little Rizoma bracket off of there and it'll just sit right there. Mm -hmm. It's just, I don't personally like. It's just a lot right there. That's I don't the like the look of this. Yeah. I mean, I do, but I don't. I don't no, like, no, no. I like this. I'd rather, I just want it a little cleaner. Right, well, if but, that's the case. Because from then, here, you know, if that's down there, it's like it's. Like, it, I like it this. Looks kinda cool, that's kind of like. And it just looks more trick. And you don't, you don't see that at all. I was, I was just, it's, it also, again, it looks cleaner. And you'll me. get a little tint of the, the gold Brembo line. We'll give a little well, let's tint of the gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, 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 I mean, you have me right there. As soon as you say that, I'm good. Yeah, cool. Yeah, let's that's that, like, man. it's hidden, yeah. but it's, it's a little different still too. there. Yeah. It's a little different. And it's, there's less, like, chunkiness right here. Yeah, too. no, no, 100%. Yeah, okay, I'm down for that. Because okay. looking even, like, I mean, you see it through the thing, but if, if, it's, yeah. if this gets painted, too, yeah. People and are like, oh, where's your... Like, no, it looks next cool. To Honestly, it looks even the gold cool. doesn't look bad there. Like, it just looks cool. Like, yeah. It'll blend it, in more, too, when it's black. Yeah, it'll look yeah. nice and clean there. You I'm cool. I mean? That's cool. Next to the gauge, I'm cool with yeah, that. That's super... And like, it's not in your line of sight. Like, I think it'll yeah. be good there, you know? That's super okay, custom. Cool. Yeah. That okay. looks sick. Yeah. Yeah, and ain't nobody gonna have this. So yeah. Once this once this gets powder coated gloss black, it's gonna look, it'll cool. look cool. Yeah, yeah. It fills in the gaps nice and yeah, it looks clean. And then you know you'll even have the extra threads on the back. So if you want to thread in a GoPro mount or whatever the hell you you know, I don't know. It'll look fine. I'm not that stuff yeah, like that is. I think it'll fine. Look cool, yeah. yeah, I'm fine. Even if cool. I never put anything in here, I, I have no cool. issue with that kind of stuff because it does work with this. It yeah, I know it looks custom and, me and mechanic, and I, and I didn't mind it because there's this chunkiness. Yeah. So having this kind yeah. of 
you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we filled in that ugly line, see, with it, that. It like, looks a hundred times better. Oh, than sick. Than yeah, yeah, I didn't see right? like, We, we cut in nice. Like we filled in the gap here. Like, it's nice. It's clean. That difference in the depth would have driven me crazy. 100%. So, me too. Yeah. Well, until, by the time it's gloss yeah, black, here, you wouldn't even notice. Yeah, it, oh, looks, dude, I it looks super clean. Yeah, and by the time it's gloss black, you're not going to see shit. Yeah, I'm definitely down for that, yeah. for so mounting it lower. Yeah, I got some more um, bolts that are going to hopefully get delivered soon. Yeah, you said oh, I, text, I texted you, yeah. He forgot one. Oh, shit. He forgot I didn't bolt. realize. I thought that that was black because I believe Thrashing supplies that. Here, follow me. And I've got a gold one. Or I can get a gold one. Oh yeah. That's what it be cut. Thanks. Fucking <laughs> guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sick. There's your black gas cap. Oh sick. Oh yeah, that powder coat, right? Yeah, yeah. Powder coat, I think this will last better this time. It's a, he said it would. He didn't even charge us. Oh really? Okay. No, he didn't charge cool. us. He just said he's cool. like, dude, how can I charge you? I'm like, that's yeah. what I was hoping he'd say. Cool. So. I'm gonna go put it up. It's definitely more bronze, it's but it looks It's completely different cool. than it, what it was. Dude, it, it, it also looks different than it did on the computer. It always <laughs> does. Hence why I have you guys pick the color. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it still looks good. Oh, yeah. It still looks good. It still looks good, man. It I'm not, the bolts a bit, Yeah, it? it does. It still looks good, man. I'm not, yeah, right. I'm not stressing about it. Anything on the side of the bolt is there, regardless. It still looks good. Yeah, yeah, that, looks, yeah. that looks great. Yeah, as soon as you kind of put it up oh, to it. Oh, that looks good, Once it's the black? Yeah. Yeah. Because it's the whole engine, right? Yeah. It's like, yeah. That's totally there's no true. old stuff so, left I, I over. Have something else to show you. Mm. All right, let's go. So we picked up some goodies from one of our other customers. He started buying motor parts because he was going to be buying another bike and building it up. We were going to build it up, obviously. Mm -hmm. Now he, the pl deal fell through, so he had a bunch of motor parts left. So he's like, "Would you buy them?" I'm like, "Well, how much?" He goes, "If you give me a third of what I paid, we got this I made soft tail Trask exhaust that you can no longer get in parts Canada." Wow. And we got M8 Screaming Eagle heads, the race heads. Oh shit. And we got <laughs> the Screaming Eagle throttle body and intake. No, wow. So we bagged the whole package from the guy. So. Damn. Yeah. You got Screaming Eagle heads yeah, on. So at least if anybody decides they want to do a motor, I don't have to make them wait five weeks. I have the heads here. So. Wow. Don't you, don't look at me. <laughs> Hey, he winked at me. Yeah. He winked at me. Can I see it though? Can we see it? Yeah, you gotta. I'm sure, you can. <laughs> you gotta open it up for the man. Hey, Pat. Shit. Alan was ear to ear when he said the trash. I looked over and Alan's like, "That's mine. That's mine." You're not gonna, you're not gonna that's buy it. Not, no, He's that's not. No, that's not That's, 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 that's not here for you. <laughs> I think in the last vlog you were like, "I'm an easy sell." And uh, <laughs> let's see. I, I, <laughs> I think I did like so this, seven. Literally, this today. box hasn't even been opened. No. Right, and the guy literally said, "What do you think I can get for it?" He's like, "Obviously, I can't get what I paid." I said, "No, you can't." He goes, "Like, it's a third of what I paid fair." I'm like, "That's fair. How much?" Those are the heads too. Dude, these are the full bracelets. Oh, so then he's like, should I put them on my spork, spork glide? So the spork glide outside has the 128 power pack in it. Oh, yeah. We did, we did on his bike two yeah. years ago. But he doesn't like the, he's like, I love the bike, I love the ride, but I don't like the noise, he's older. Oh. He's like, I want it to be quiet, I was gonna put a muffler. I said, dude, don't you're, put these. I said, don't, yeah, I said, don't put it, and then put a big muffler on the back. It's, yeah. it's, it's absolutely pointless. There they are. <sighs> Never been opened. Until now, just for you, Matt. Until now. All right, well, let's Ooh. talk about that. Let's talk about the performance that we would get out of this. <laughs> <laughs> What's it, there to talk about? It's big. And then this, this is more reliable than doing like the 130, what was it? 136, 136. it's 136. not a stroker motor. You can do the 136 stroker motor. Problem is you're touching the bottom end. Yeah, From yeah, exactly. the minute you split the case, I don't give a damn what anybody tells you, and change the crank and run a stroker motor, you guys ain't cruising down the highway. Yeah, and I'm not looking to do that with this bike right now. But if now. you keep everything, if anybody is building this, your bike, your style of bike, and they keep everything to bolt-ons, they're fine. So I'll tell you, this is the difference between Alan's bike, for example, that has your same cylinder kit yeah. with these heads, making 156. Oh, uh, me. And 165 foot-pounds. Oh, we're gonna do it. So. We're, we're doing it. Yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. We yeah. have to, right? 
I mean, we have to. It's like you bought these knowing we were coming in tonight. You know what it was? We have to do it. We have to do it. You know what it was? When he asked me, I was like, the heads are right there. I have to go. He was like, I already know who's gonna, I know, he's not, I know he's gonna watch this. I better not say no. (laughs) Yeah. So I kind of had to say yes. Yeah. And the thing I, with the, I have to do it though. The thing like, with them is that we don't even. Because I already talk. talked to you about this. Before. <laughs> I know. You've I talked to him about off. This three or four times yeah, already. I've literally messaged Dan, be like, should we do you, it? Did you mess Dan about your dream last night? I had a weird dream that you oh, did yeah, a bunch you were of dreaming about me. Yeah, <laughs> 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 legit. I had a, so I had this dream that you did a bunch of research and you were like, you figured out that uh, fueling was a better long-lasting product than SNS. So you're like, we need to replace all your SNS parts with, with fueling. fueling. And I was like, all right, we'll pull the SNS or cam out. And I was like, give me the biggest fueling cam you can do because I just wanted the most horsepower out of my bike. It was like two nights ago I had that dream. So I, I it's a sign. It's it's a ridiculous it's a dream, but I need to. You were probably talking in your sleep, being like, I literally power. woke up and I was like, I want a bigger cam in my bike because I just wanted well, now more big- power. Guess what? With this. You have to put a bigger camera. All right, and we're doing it. We're doing do it, Pat. You also have to do a clutch. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh God, what am I doing? What am I well, getting? it's on camera now that you're doing it. Well, you already said, and we can't edit it out because you know. <laughs> All right. Let's go for it. <laughs> All right. Good thing you upgraded those brakes. <laughs> <laughs> Another sign is the motor's open. We're yeah. four bolts away from oh, pulling the heads off. Right? So those are Screaming Eagle heads. Oh, okay. So those are Screaming Eagle race heads. This right. is an s and cylinder kit. Those are like, is that what's in like King of the Baggers? I don't know. <laughs> like they're like, like they they're have. like they're top. I think they have for like, full, like well, the see. big board. Like, but they have know. screaming eagle stuff because well, they're yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, what, I don't know what horsepower we're gonna get out of this thing, but it's gonna be a hell of a lot. You said more. over 150. Oh, it's gonna be and nice. like over 160 for. Football. Well, what's sick is we're gonna get the we get to have this back on the dyno too. So this is gonna go back on the dyno. After. Are you gonna make it to Montreal? Is this gonna be done oh, before fuck, May yeah. 17th? Oh, May 17th. You don't see that we're still here. Yeah, we're we're in April, whatever. This shit will easily. Are you kidding me? I'll have this thing done next week. Okay, what cam are we putting in it? Can we put in a fueling cam? <laughs> Just because because I, I gotta dream. put a fueling in this yeah, time. I think I want yeah, to put, do, do fueling. We'll go one under their biggest. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's look at it. We need to do a cam. It's gonna be insane. And we need to do a clutch. So you came in to Just do, do your brakes. We got you to buy. The, the thrash and triple trees. He triple trees. People better keep watching our vlogs, man. <laughs> Shit is not cheap. <laughs> Let's go in the clutch. front. The clutch is going to be the concern now because we have to figure out how crazy you want to go. Stop swearing. I got it. Sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm jacked up. I'm not faking it. I'm like... 538 cam. Aggressive camshaft with a nasty sound. Revs up fast and pulls hard in engines with big bore cylinders, modified cylinder heads, intake, compression, and exhaust. The Reaper 538 grind will shine in 124 and larger cubic engine, blah, blah, blah. Ported cylinder heads are not required, but will complement the cam and add even more power throughout the range. The stock throttle body produces an excellent power band and the use of a high flow throttle body will increase peak power numbers. An exhaust is recommended and performance hair filter. Fueling recommends matching this cam with race here the oiling system high valve springs are required those heads have it already yeah. se cylinder heads have high lift valve springs but will need to be verified which is the ones you're getting heavy duty one piece push rods also recommended but now 598 592 getting serious with bore size ported cylinder heads and throttle body aggressive camshaft requiring high load valve strings performance push rods and lifters high floats whatever 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 fueling also reminds matching blah, blah, blah. high lift valve springs heavy duty push rods are highly recommended push rod. yeah so uh 592 2850 to 6250 power band. 538, 2250 to 6250. If you want to go fueling, it appears the biggest they have is 592. Or you go one under the biggest, which is a 538. Which, for the record, SNS uses a 550 grind cam mm-hmm. for their power pack kit. Yeah. Which is just the 128 without cylinder heads. Yeah. They claim that a 550 is the best for it. It looks like they've got a, and I'm not suggesting we do yeah. this, but it looks like uh, Fueling's got a 630 cam. Yeah, probably. Uh, like on their I knew there was, no, it probably is. That's why I said there's, there used to be a new section. When it comes to performance engine parts for Harleys, their two biggest are Fueling and SNS. And if we yes. have problems, we can call them and deal with it. Other places, Revolution Performance is pretty big too. If 618 is the biggest M8 camshaft they have, yeah. we're not using it regardless. Right. right? We want to go one under the biggest. Which is the 590. Which Dude. is the 592. If you want to go fueling, that's the one. It'll be big, a lot bigger than what you have now. Their actual cam size depicts the intake valve lift almost, not on the 465. So on the 540, it's actually intake valve 540. 
Mm. Whereas what we're going with now, the lift is 578 intake and 592 exhaust. If what you have now works great and we know it's making a little less power than it could have with a bigger can, totally. if you're gonna go with the heads, then it only makes sense to go with this bigger can. This bike's gonna be nice. Okay. It's gonna make sense that it's in the performance section in Montreal now, yeah. huh? That was too easy of a sell. <laughs> I gotta. <laughs> you see what I just got? Do you have any gold? This wasn't even planned at all. Okay. I'm an easy sell, but I am particular about what I want. Okay. He just, Dan just knows what I want. How's the clutch on your bike? It's all right. Is I have it hard? No, it's How the does same. Feel? It's all right. It's stiff, but it's it's different with but my. Hard, hard, or it's nice. No, it's it's stiff. It's not hard. It's stiff. Okay, so I'm gonna need some time to work on the clutch. Yeah, that's fine. I don't want to just put a. So we can buy one of these race clutches from Scorpion. Mm -hmm. Normally, I would just put a lockup clutch, like a, a a variable compensator, so that you could see this little beautifulness spinning around mm -hmm. with a clear derby cover. It's cool, but given you have yeah, we have the derby cup. cover, you're not gonna want to put a clear one, regardless of what yeah, you get to no, see. Yeah, no, I keep that covered. Yeah, exactly. So there's no point. Yeah. And then because of what you're doing. And because of what we've done in the past on other bikes, especially his, yeah, his had one of these full low-profile Scorpion clutches, mm -hmm. not this lockup, just the full set. Yeah. And the only thing that we found broke on his clutch was his stock clutch baskets. The stock clutch baskets are absolute trash. His clutch kept giving us problems and we couldn't figure out what the hell was wrong with it. And then after we were switching his race clutch, which is this one, mm -hmm. from the DR, and putting it in the ST, yeah. we're like, oh, now we know why your DR's clutch has always been a pain in the tits. Mm. This, the actual clutch basket was cracked, had hairline cracks everywhere. Okay. So it was expanding. So we bought Alan for his new one, yeah. this Trask yeah. basket, yeah. Yeah, see, yeah, yeah. and then the lockup clutch. So we're either gonna get you the Barnett basket mm. or the Trask basket. Sure. Probably the Barnett, just because we're gonna go with the Barnett clutch and we wanna make sure there's no footman issues, which is what we did on his ST. Mm -hmm. At least then we know it'll be bulletproof forever. Okay. Yeah. I mean, again, that's what I want out of all this. Yeah. Well, it'll be a full right? setup. So it's going to be the entire clutch. So it's hub, yeah. pressure plate, springs. It'll come with plates, everything you need, heavy duty. And you're going to get a billet blast, a billet clutch basket. Okay. So that eliminates all the weaknesses. Now, the only other thing that everybody has talked about that I've been hearing about since the dawn of time is the compensators are weak. But. Okay. Alan's compensator was mint, even after we took it apart. And you ain't, um, you guys ride hard, but you ain't riding like him. He's just a nasty animal. Yeah. So he, he just, he really is. He's, he's an animal. Yeah, so, so I've heard, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> that being said, um, I wouldn't waste the money on the compensator. Yeah, I think it'll be all right. The new ones, compensators are blowing up, full blown, blowing into four pieces. Oh yeah? So their new ones are garbage, but Yours is fine. I'm gonna look into the clutch. I'll leave this catalog because I'm gonna have to go on their website and compare yeah, part numbers and make damn sure I get what, exactly what we need. Yeah. So I'll get that. I'll order the can we just discussed. You gotta bring me the injectors. Motor's open, the yeah. box came in. Thank God, because I was gonna make him bolt it today. My intention today <laughs> was to come in. That's why I told you tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, Because yeah, I yeah. wanted to have your motor put together. So when you came tomorrow, I could be like, ta-da. Yeah, so but then we got so this busy. worked out way better yeah, anyway. I, I was not. I'm not. This was not planned. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, Ed came from Angus, Ontario, yeah. with his ST, with his whatever the hell that is, of Sport Glide. Sport Glide. And oh, this right, guy right. was here the whole time. He's like, by the way, could I sell? Da -da 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 -da. And we're like, uh, yeah. He's like, well, maybe when I come pick it up, I'll bring them. I said, dude, bring them. I'll take them for sure. And then he goes to his truck and goes, here you go. I'm like, oh, you have them with you? He goes, yeah, I'll just, whatever, we'll work it out. And I was like, okay. Then we started talking. What do you think I can get? A third of what I paid. I'm like, yeah, man, absolutely. Leave them here. And that was it. That was not planned. Yeah. It was I, meant I to be. I believe it. It's it just was meant, meant to be. I, no, I agree. I agree. Because okay. how, how much I've kind of thought about this and gone yeah, back and forth with absolutely. it. Absolutely. Yeah, I was gonna do it eventually. It so the fact that they're here, <laughs> these parts just fell into your lap. I, literally. Yeah. yeah. The yeah. fact that they're here, coupled with the fact that you had sexual, non-sexual <laughs> dreams about me, <laughs> this is meant to be. I got about five <laughs> seconds of saying no. I'm not gonna do it before I said yes. No yeah. means yes in this show. I know. I know. <laughs> So bring me the injectors, okay. I'll order the cam. I'll, I gotta sort out part numbers and make monster. sure I get you the right clutch things. Yeah. Um, if it's all, in, if it's not in stock, cause I know you don't care about ordering direct, I'll just call them order direct. Yeah, yeah. All right. There's nothing else to discuss. We have everything we need. Yeah, we're in, we're good. Wow. Oh, okay. uh, hold on a second. We're gonna have to take the cylinders and pistons off now and do the base gaskets. That's fine. I have them anyway. We're good. <sighs> Look at the port work. Oh wow, yeah. You can see Damn, it. dude. You can see that, yeah, instantly. 
CNC porting. That's all CNC porting. Yeah, is that what that is? So just this, what horsepower just from doing this difference? If, if I had to just throw a number guessing, what I would tell somebody, 20. Oh, just from that, dude. Yeah. Well, all the power is made in the head, so you can this only make so huge. much with the cylinder board, right? right? Hey, if we can get around 150 horse and it's still reliable and tuned the way you think it yeah. should be, I would be stoked. What you do with the bike, I'm straight up targeting a perfect riding machine. Yeah. Peak that's... horsepower don't mean shit to me. Yeah. So. And that's really what it is, too, is like how it feels on the road. It already feels fast as hell. Yeah, it is fast as numbers hell. Is... His oh, idle is nasty, especially yeah. with the new Trask exhaust we're putting on, is going to be... I want to hear it. I, I haven't heard it at all yet. His? Yeah, I it's haven't heard it. This bike, you always love the attention. I mean, this <laughs> this thing already sounded like a muscle Speaking car. Of, did you get a film of his sweat t-shirt? I got yeah, it, yeah, yeah, I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he's repping. What do you got on there now? What exhaust do you have on now? The Masani. Tonight was better because tomorrow was a yeah, yeah. nightmare tomorrow. Thanks, dude. Do you know how many people I was telling off today? And Alvin, <laughs> and Alvin was like, what are you doing walking in here? Get out. Like, go stand in the back. <laughs> that's why we have the gate up yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. One day, yeah. that's all it takes. Yeah, but anyway. Okay, one one nice later, day, dude. man. Yep. It's like one nice day. It's crazy. Cool. We'll see you guys soon. Okay, yeah. Thanks, guys. guys. I'll bring the injectors soon. Yeah, I'll okay. talk to you tomorrow. When okay. I oh, yeah, bring the injectors. All right, guys, there you have it. Uh, this vlog definitely took a turn. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, none of that was planned. None of Not that was scripted. All. Neither one of us knew. You didn't know either. I didn't right? know. He told us to come tonight, and he had those parts there sitting. I mean, knew that Matt was gonna bite. It fell into your lap, literally. Yeah, it did. So, so that means we're getting the bike back on the dyno. We're gonna get to see what numbers it's gonna be putting out. New cam, fueling New cam, cam, just like I had that weird dream about. All right, let's wrap this up. Until next time, can't wait to show you guys more. The bike's gonna be on the road soon, a few weeks. For in time for a roll of bones. Keep watching, let's go. Like and subscribe. <laughs>